getting started with automated statements for CS SoftDent software. Automated statements lets you send professional statements to your patients with the click of a mouse. If you are not currently a subscriber, contact your CareStream representative for more information at 800-262-8593. With the Automated Statement Service, your statements are transmitted by eServices and sent to a clearinghouse where they are printed and mailed to your patients. You automatically receive a report with a list of patients who will receive a statement. Let's start by taking a look at the settings for Automated Statements. To set up Automated Statements, select System, Change System Settings, Billing Statements. Click Edit, and in the Cycle Billing section, verify that Enable Cycle Billing is selected. In the Cycle Billing Period field, type the number of days in the billing period. The recommended setting is 25, which means SoftNet will not generate a statement within 25 days of previous statement transmission. To edit the message that prints on the billing statement, click Messages. Message text can be edited for current accounts, accounts 30 days overdue, 60 days overdue, 90 days overdue, and statements printed during an office visit. Click OK to save any changes. Some statement settings can be configured at the account level. To access an account, click List Account and then Open an Account Record. Statement options are located in the lower right corner of the account window. To add a note that will appear on a billing statement for this account only, type a message in the Notes to appear on Billing Statements field. Select an option to determine if this account will receive statements online, by mail, or both. When the Online option is selected, the statement is sent via email, so an email address is required. Click the Contact Info tab and check the Email field for a valid email address. When setup is complete, you can quickly generate bills to transmit to our clearinghouse. From the main menu, select Reports, Accounting, Statements, Electronic, Electronic Batch Preview. The Electronic Statements window is displayed. Select the starting and ending names to include in the batch using the drop-down lists in the Start and End fields. To include billing information for accounts that contain a specific user code, type the user code in the Only Include Accounts With field. To exclude billing statement information for accounts that contain a specific user code, type the user code in the Exclude Accounts With field. Accounts that have been referred to a collection agency, are inactive, involved in a legal case, or have been flagged for exclusion, are excluded by default. Setup changes made on this screen, including the statement message, will apply only to this batch of statements. Click OK to generate statements. Accounts that are more than 90 days past due are displayed in red, and accounts with no address or a partial address are unchecked, displayed in blue, and display an invalid address status when they are selected. In this window, you can manage your batch before sending. Click a column header to sort by account name, total account balance, or amount due. Highlight an account and click Edit Account to change the address or enter a new address. To exclude any account from this batch, deselect the checkbox. To preview a specific statement, select the account and click Preview. To add an individual note to a statement, type the note in the Personalized Statement Note for Selected Account field. After reviewing the list, click Send. The Output Options window is displayed so you can print a report. Select an Output option and click OK. The statements are then sent to a batch file for transmission. If you click Cancel, the batch file is not created. SoftDent generates the electronic statement file. Click Yes to start transmission. During transmission, the transmission status is displayed. When the file is successfully sent, the Report List window is displayed. Customize the report output by setting a date range and selecting the reports to include. This concludes getting started with automated statements for CS SoftNet software.